Hello, Kai's crew. I'm Kai's corner, and so far, like, I'm in a much better day. I mean, technically, well, not really before, but a much better day compared to how I, how I was feeling in the last, the last, like, last reacting to reacting to my old embarrassing stories that I used to write, but I mean, that I used to write. I mean, I'm feeling so sort of better right now. I mean, the morning, like the noon was, yeah. I I rather go to regular school. Yeah. In spring, time in homeschool, I get less freedom. Like it's usually supposed to be in reverse, but nope. In homeschool, I get less freedom. That's probably all I'm gonna say. And I get more like stressed and work out. Because you know I'm and I won't I'm forced and I won't really be talking to that much about it, but yeah. So I guess I'm in a much better mood, so I mean I got some rest and I got to listen to music and you know just yeah, enjoy some of my life, and yeah, I was like planning to like do, like could, like finish up some like some online tests and all that stuff, but yeah, I didn't really feel like it right now. So, cause like I was so, like I was already feeling down, so I tried to chill me chill myself up, and okay, so news on my video schedule. So I decided to work on. Like, I think I'm gonna call the project the Spirit of the Crystal Ball since that's basically what I should call it now. The Spirit of the Crystal Ball. So I'm like, is that gonna be the new name? I mean, it's not a series, it's just a it's just a mini movie. Like it's not a series, it's just gonna like be there as itself. So yeah, I, no, I rather call it Orbuculum because it's about the backstory of Orbuculum, which yeah, you're not gonna get it unless you like I'm already st like I'm always starting the introduction and the voiceover. Yep, voiceover. But I didn't bring my phone right now since I done it yesterday, not today. So and then I don't know the fallen angels. Still gonna be working on that and like so far like for now I have no music videos planned. I mean, I'm listening to so many good songs, but yeah, so far I got no music videos planned, so yep. Plus, I already finished that music video, which again, the word of hmm, the word for two months, two months, or yeah, two months, I guess, since that's how I like schooling going, and you know. <sighs> Yep, so again, the word of the two months is hope, or the yell. The word of the yell is hope. So, let's hope, everybody. Already done that speech, so. Except it was improvised. Yeah, I didn't want the script. I mean, I was playing to before, but then I ended up improvising. So, yeah, let's continue this hell of a story. Yep, so we're going to be continuing. Oh my god, I got the tile wide. I, I'm confused when I got. Yep, study buddy dates, except with an S, so I need to change that once I get my phone. So, study buddy dates, so let's finish this hell of a story. Since we're all done with Kenya. Finally, like, officially, well, officially done with Kenya. We're done with that hell of a story, and it dropped in the pits of hell, so. Yep, let's do this. When the bus stops stop at us, they do what they usually do, which is go see Waki and Gumbel and Darling sit next to each other. Gumbel, Darling said, Oh, who are you? How do you know my name? Gumbel asks, uh, Carol turned me into a ghost for our science project. Oh, wow, not freaking out. Like, ah! Or something like that. I mean, you already seen a ghost, so. Yeah, that was a bad <laughs> Okay, just another ghost. Okay. 
So where's Carol? Anyways, gonna bail us again. I'm like he. I'm like her. It says her. I'm like her. Carol's like getting off of Gumbel's butt. Ha. Oh my god, I crossed this photo out because I accidentally drew Dolan as a human again. Yeah, this was a mistake. Then Gumbel, Dolan, and Carol all laugh together. Ha. Until, until, until Gumbel stopped laughing. Why are you sitting by him? She asks. Because Rocky and Miss Simon was Simon, that was us, told us that we have to sit to our partner, said Darling. Um, okay. Ha. So she listened to them and sit with Pamela. So, Pamela, I'm just saying that when we walk together, then I seem that we could just be walk. Wait, what? That so when we walk together, I see that we could just be friends, except except a uh, boyfriend and girlfriend. Said Gumbel. Oh wow! So they're just gonna break up all because of a project, which makes no sense. Like, there's no exposition in this. There's seriously no exposition of why they decide to break up. It's just, you know, let's break up because, you know, we walk like this. What? Now, that makes no sense at all. Like, if you walking together just fine, then why do you guys need to break up? And I'm confused. I'm just freaking confused right now. Since, like, before, like, you guys were walking on the party just fine, and then... You know, you decide to break up? This... This story... This... Like... What? This can't be like the most confusing thing I ever wrote! What? Like, seriously, like... I mean... I don't... I mean, based on boy lover, I don't support of this relationship, but now you're just fucking fine. Like this is some... like seriously, you guys should have broken up in the last story. That'd be great, but in this one, I don't see anything wrong with it. Like if it wasn't boy lover, then yes, break up with Pelo. But in this, just this is. Like, it should have been reversed. It should have been reversed. It's just that. Okay, sure, because I like being friends of you, says the one. Gumbel and Pamela hug. Then they will ask school and get off the bus. Still, like, it should have been reversed. Like, that's just confusing. That's just confusing. When Gabriel Darling walked to the hallways, Darling said, Ah, I love life. You all had to say it even at the day before you live with us, Gabriel. Sorry, but li life is beautiful. It's spelled B E A U T F U L without an I. She said, Then all the animals came, the same animals from the voice. Okay, that. I for I forgot. I seriously forgot if those animals were, like dangerous or I don't I forgot to be honest. Came to her. Yikes, she said, maybe I should get adopted by a fish. You already did get adopted twice. Ah, it's a ghost, one of the deals said. Let's run for it, said the turtle. So all the animals run but the turtle can't. Ha huh. One, so one of the birds carry him. Wow, so good about Dolan. Okay, this one isn't colored. So they continued walking to class. 
When everyone at class, they put their project behind Miss Sim Simon's desk. When Miss Simon came to her class, she acted the she acted wait she acted the kids like kindergarten. What's the month? She asked. February. Everyone said all oh, bored. What's today? She asked again. February fifteenth. They all said even bolder. Come on, Miss Simon, stop treating us like babies. Said Gumball. Then Darling started drawing on Gumball's desk and she sits next to her. Then Gumball and Darling had in Darling's turned Darling's head into her. Find who's going first. Pick me, Miss Simon said. Josina, Josina, and I thought those names can't get even weirder. Now about Carol, since he waiting pol polite polite politely okay, it's full spell right back. She says so. Darling and Carol went up. So do you have and so do you have a goalie tactic project for me? Said Miss Simon. Then she started to laugh, and Darling suspiciously, supposed to say suspicious, laugh with Miss Simon. Ha! Ah, no. She said when she stopped laughing, "This is a play, so you may watch us on the screen." She said. So Dolly and Carol go by the door, and Miss Simon turn off the light. Dolly, could you blow some of that air for me? Carol said. Okay, I'm not trying like so off. Okay, talking like a scientist from some video, so. What do they sound like? Like, Dolly, could you blow some air for me? Is that what they sound like? Sure, and I will huff and puff like the big bad wolf. The big bad wolf, she says. So she blows some air out the jar. Then Carol holds the jar that only ghosts touch and opens the cap. Then everyone gaps. It's empty, said Gumball. Okay, well at least we don't you know that the that breath don't sink. So everyone clapped and they both bow. Okay. And this one, like, is the same thing as what you saw before. Okay, so next is Gumbell and Palos and Miss Simon. So they come up. Who do you want to be? God? Frankenstein? You know, Frankstein, Frankstein, Dracoclan, it's spelled D-R-A-C-A-C-L-A-N. Gumbel said in a deep voice, oh my god, who do you want to be? God, Frankenstein, Dracoclan. Okay, not again, he said. Then everyone laughed except Miss Simon. Or oh, ghost like Carol. She content she contied. Then Miss Simon started to laugh a bit. Gumbell takes the swip, said Panelo. Fire Mr. Smarty Pants. Okay, now they're fighting. Like this is just so forced. Then Gumbell do the same experiment as she do in practice. Then everyone clapped. You guys are wonderful. Even you, Gumbell, you didn't read the script, said Miss Simon. I can't believe I'm going to say this, but you're on the honor roll. Just because of one project? Just because of one project, you're on the honor roll. Just because of one project, you're on the honor roll. And it's February! <gasps> Yay, they both said. Then the script fell out of Gumbel's hand when she dancing. Then Miss Simon looked at the paper and it says everything she said. Even the part when Gumbel pretend not to read the script. <laughs> okay, that's pretty okay, that's pretty clever. Gumbel she shouted and they stopped dancing. What she said, I found your plan. Okay, I didn't even finish this. So you both get a F. Then they walk back to their seats. Okay, so what was the project again? Oh my god, I didn't finish this. You can tell. Oof.
Next is Carmen and Alex. So when Miss Simon was talking, Gumbel Dolan went to the hallway. When they're at the hallway, Gumbel make a suspicious. It says supis. Suspicious. Okay, supis face. Then she also crossed her arms and face it to Dolan. What she asked. You and kill her thing, said Gumbel. What? No, we aren't. No, we aren't, said Dolan. You turn into a ghost to be in love with him? Okay, well, that just went out of nowhere. Everything is just so out there, like, splattering. Like, I don't know what to call it. It's just, like, first they broke up. Like, why did they have to broke up? Like, seriously, this should have came... Doing the boy lover, then that would make more sense, but then she always doesn't. She said, you know that will wear off tomorrow. She said, and a few minutes later, Miss Simon told them to go to the classroom, so they did. That's a lesson that we're all gonna say, so are you all friends? Miss Simon asked. Yes, yeah, said everyone together. Yes, 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 that's more like it. She said, jumping on, what the, her own desk. I'm confused. I'm so confused. Like, everything is just random, random, random. Like, it's just a book full of randomness. It showed me, Miss Simon, but I like to say, say but I like to say, uh, but I like to say that you say whoever jumped on Miss Simon's desk gets detection, said Dolly. So she gets out of the desk and sits back in the room. Why am I so rude? She said. That just went out of nowhere. Like, these stories are like the most confusing things ever. And speaking of that, oh my god, there were like so many mistakes that I made with the pen. Yep, this one is called, Let's Celebrate Friday! Even though it's not Friday! Just we're gonna read this hell of a story, even though it's not Friday! And they were like, my first name, my, like my middle name initial, since I don't like my middle name. Okay, so. Like, look at the mistake I found. Also, still kind of like add that tail, even though it looks so, so out of place with the whole, you know, outfit. Oh, and of course, it's you guys probably don't know what this is. It's a rainbow. Look at it. Yep, you guys probably didn't know this, but what is this? It's a rainbow, just so you don't know. Just thought that it was a splash full of crap, but nope, it's a rainbow. When it was the middle of the day, Gumbella Dolling went to Prince Pal Prince of Pal Prince of Pal Brown's office. Why do you bring us here, Prince of Pal? I saw you spell principal. Brown? Gumbel asked. Remember last Friday where you get in trouble? He said tapping his chin. Or taping. It says taping his chin. A a lot. Yeah, said Gumbel. It was the best, Darling added. Then it show a flashback on last Friday. You mean last week? Since, you know, let's celebrate Friday. Isn't that what it says? When, when when lunch was over, they go to Mr. Small's class, the high teacher. Um, okay, everyone, since it's a Friday, let's calm down with some deep breaths. Uh, it says deep breath. Then everyone sit crisscross applesauce and close their eyes and be calm so you won't get crazy in the future. I'm so crazy in the future. I mean, I'm crazy right now in this before. Whoop. 
Po, o, o. Then when they go to Miss Simon's classroom, they go crazy like Cocoa Puff. Exactly. Ooh. Is that supposed to be a cherry or an apple? It looks more like a cherry. Miss Watson! Oh my god, I'm gonna do the voice impression since I feel like it. You're going, I mean, the voice is where I remember. You're going to, in detection tomorrow! Simon Simon, yes, I'm gonna do the impressions. If you don't like, if you like them or not, then, you know, I've, you know, let's celebrate Friday, even though it's not Friday. Um, you can't do that because tomorrow is Saturday! She said, that's on the table, then the flashback was over. Ah, good times, said Gumbel. Uh, so you promise you won't do that? Uh, uh, yeah, yes, Prince, yes, Prince Pal Brown, uh, two sat together, oh, come on, wait, what? Um, this looks like this ending. Um, said, okay, good, now go back to class. So Gumbel and Dolling walked to their classes. At the end of the day, the bell rang like all the time. Yay! It's the end of Friday," said Gumbel. "Yeah, that's my voice for Gumbel." Then, and darling, oh wait, they said it together. Okay. Well, I can't do two voices at the same time. Not again," said Miss Simon. "What do you mean?" she said. "You're fighting! Stop overreacting! Oh, you know, who's? Oh my God! I got the wrong voice. Okay. Stop! Oh, oh my God! My voice cracks too." Like to say to sound like this high. Stop overreacting, Miss Sign Sign. Prince Pal Brown told us that we can't do that, said Dolling. And we promise him, Gumbel said, crossing. That's that's her arms. Okay, what the okay, what are these? Oh my god, again with those Good, so you should go to the bus, she said. So, go about doing why the bus, they go back home. Oh, I didn't know they wanted the bus. I mean, it's getting better, like, each story. Like, the problems are getting better in each story. At least I'm not, like, at least something's worth happening in this series. Unlike the case series where it's just, you know, going to school, do the stuff, blah, 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 blah. At least, you know, like, the pacing is much better here. So, yeah, I like this much better. Yeah, because, you know, David, like this, like these, like this series has a much better pacing than, you know, the Kenya series. When they went home, they just sit around here, and, and it's starting to be a boring Friday for them. What now? Darling asked. Oh, oh, I got one, said Gumball. We could make a realistic, a realistic, it's supposed to say realistic, they come true. What do you mean? Darling asked. For, for waking one eye. Example, if there was a brainstorm, then there would be a storm full of brains. Yeah, and we could put it, uh, yeah, and we could put it, uh, yeah, and we could put it, in our TV show, said Dolly. Oh my god, that's my voice. That they both screamed joyfully. Okay. And that skirt is so high. Like, seriously. Then Annie's opened her door. That head just pops up. And they like, that skirt is so short. And again, with the. Like. I feel uncomfortable staring at this, to be honest. My god, I forgot to do the voice. Hey, I'm busy with my tea party, she said. 
seriously about that coming upstairs. Uh, why are you smart at playing with baby toys? He said, Pity Anna used his cheeks. Okay. Um, but one of my friends do that, and he said back, How do you have friends if you didn't even go to school? Oh, so he doesn't go to school? I mean, yeah, I forgot to sew, so Dolly asked. It's me, it's me, it's me. Dolly jumped. No, it's Daisy the donkey. She said, Hop, hobbling, hobbling her toy. Um, okay. Hey, why do you make us off topic? Gumbel asked. Because I don't want to hear about your stupidity. So, she said, then, then they ignored Annie's and started with their show. Okay. You gotta be kidding me with this again. First, they lip sync, take on the world, and then they started doing the show. Okay, well, at least we don't have to suffer through that filler again. Thank goodness, like, the pacing is so much better here. Like, this gotta be my favorite out of them all. I mean, you know, it's not as good as the love combat, but... I mean, like, it's a close second, so, yeah, this gotta be my favorite so far. Hi, hi, Gumbel Watson and Darling. Gumbel paused. When it said Beaver Darling's last name? Like, seriously, the jokes are now getting more clever as it goes. Like, Darling. Like, seriously, I'm starting to enjoy this right now. I'm here to show you one of our best activity on Fridays. Gumbel finished. Hey, said Darling. Sorry, dude. I don't know your last name. What's them? She said. That's it. I'm going to pay you back. Stick to the script. Dolly got a whisper. Oh, yeah. Here are the options. Um. Okay, I don't, I don't know what that was supposed to say. My God. So far, I'm enjoying it. They decided to do the show. Waiting cats and dogs! Gabriel Dolly yelled. So people say that there's waiting cats and dogs. And here's a video when I was six. <laughs> she said that there was a video in the amazing world of Gabriel Dolly Cam and the screen get bigger. Ooh. Like seriously, it looks like that. It should be in the actual show. I'm not even joking. Like, so far, I'm enjoying this. Like, this should be in the actual show. Gumbel, Gumbel, those rain cats and dogs, said Nicole. I really like a cat, said Gumbel. Oh my god. I think I'm starting to remember when I took, um, big speech too seriously. Then the video was over. Okay. Oh my god, what the F? Again. Everyone said in uh, X Bill. But now it's not. Watch it, look. She said that it showed Gumbel specking cat. Okay, so like. I speak dog and I speak cat because with dog I go <coughs> but with cats I go <coughs> Are you sure this is a good idea? Dolly asked. Sure is it? Well sure it is, Gabriel whispered that she spat cat and the cat back back. So I don't know, I don't have a cat, I, I only have a dog, and, you know, I used to have a fish, but, you know, Jim passed away, so, I only have a dog. Meow, 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 meow,
okay, I'm done. What did she say? Darling said that I'm. Wait, no, darling, she said that I'm the coolest cat, and she said I'm the coolest cat. Yes, said Darling with the gumbell. Then she kept on saying meow. Then all the cats come. Bullseye, they both said that the care about we want when all the dogs are chasing her. Okay, those don't look like dogs. Ah, oh, sorry. Meow, the care about. Okay, well, I'm surprised that cats didn't come up here and, you know, bark or, like, seriously bark because I'm saying, meow. Like, I'm surprised cats didn't come up here. But seriously, they don't look like dogs. And a cat with those arms. And if you guys don't know, cats is my dog, so. Then the camera, then the car man rewind it. We win it. When they were done, they were at set. Hey, Dolly, it's raining cats and dogs, said Gabriel. Oh, they both said when the camera rewind back. While the camera rewind, the music started and Gumball and Dolan yelled out, Hot dogs, they totally come up. Okay, guys, it's not lunchtime, just hot dog is. Okay. Uh, express to like before Mrs. Mom adopted me. Okay, don't get it. Gabelle go cuckoo about hot dog. Here's a scene, she said. Then turn on the remote. The setting take by the kitchen. Then turn it full screen. So everyone came, so everyone can see it. What are we having for dinner? Thanks for asking, because Gabelle asked. Um, we're having hot dog. You know, let me do the voice. We're having hot dogs! I can't do it. So we should. Uh oh, said Gobbo. Not a hot dog! Said Gobbo that she carried the hot dog and put it in the refrigerator. I told you she was. I told I told you we shouldn't make hot dogs at Annie's. When the hot dog was almost cold, she gave the. She gave it to the dog. Okay, so is it supposed to be like this? Cannibalism? I don't know what to call it. Here you go, dogs. Have your freedom, said Gabel. Then all the, then, then all. Then her world music came. The dogs eat it while Gabel laughed. Okay, so she thinks it's cannibalism. Wow. The darling turned off the screen and music, so that Gabel, funny and embarrassing video, she said. Darling said, "Try not to laugh." <laughs> oh my God! Yeah, to be honest, I think this story is well. I mean, not this whole series in general. Just only this one story is better than the love combat. Like it was a hard choice, but you know the love combat was like so bad, it's hilarious, and you know the only saving grace was you know Lucas and Paisley, you know those characters, but like this, like the entire, like the like all of the characters, like seriously, like I think that this is better than love combat to be honest. Like the love combat was just so cheesy and like so repetitive and like so bleh. While, like, Paisley and Lucas were the only saving grace until Paisley, like, saw, like, fall downhill at the end, but, yeah, so, yeah, this got me, yeah, so this is better than love combat, so let's celebrate Friday is better than the love combat. It's official, everybody, we found a old story that is better than the love combat. Woo! That she gave up and started laughing. <laughs> Dolly got out that angry. Let's start the video right now, Dolly said very quickly. So she turned on the remote quickly. 
quickly, quickly, quickly. How I do this quickly? <laughs> the camera show Gumbel and Richard at the dog fashion show. Okay, Dad, you promise you won't eat the stylus dog in the wonderful and beautiful outfit? Gumbel asks um, in a French accent. Oh, oh, okay. So let me do it in a French accent. Okay, Dad, Dad, yo. <laughs> oh my God, it's British. You promise you won't eat the stylish dog in their wonderful and beautiful outfits. Okay, of course not, girl, Bill, because I know I'll eat bones, but not dog bones. And which you eat bones? <laughs> it's bad than a love combat. Like, there's more funny jokes here. Good, said Gobel. Now it's so time that the camera rewind to the dog fashion show. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the the dogs in the beautiful outfit. <laughs> ah! <laughs> the the photo is like so bad. It's hilarious. Like seriously, I like this better than love combat. I can't say this enough. Like there's more funnier jokes. Every character was excellent. Like this would be in the real show. Is it the real show? I haven't watched it for a long time. <laughs> Sandwich <laughs> in French accent. The stage opened and it shows a bunch of hot dogs with goo goo eyes with permanent markers smile and they have doll clothes and the only ones controlling them. <laughs> Thank God. We are the dogs! We are the dogs! <laughs> the dogs sing through me their streets to make the hot dogs sing! Mmm, <laughs> hot dogs! Which is that drooling for hunger that Dolly cutted singing. We could stop by no one! Don't eat us! Or we eat you! <laughs> Never thought I'd find a better story than a love combat. <laughs> oh, please, how do you do that? He said, walking on the stage. Uh, come and get us. Like, seriously, this is really a best Friday. Ah, now I'm feeling it. Oh, I'm feeling the Friday. Woo, woo! Dolly said. Still controlling the hot dogs, but which had already eaten, including the clothes. <sighs> like seriously, the pacing is excellent. Like, the pacing is so much good. Like this is the best. This is the best. My like, God, need to remake this story. That would be so good. Like seriously, who wants me to remake this story? Because I think I might. <laughs> No, Dad, Gabel cried. Mm, that was too easy, he said that he started talking to Gabel. So where are the dogs? <laughs> like seriously, these jokes are like more funny or like like they're meant to be funny and that's why it's funny finally I'm laughing at my own jokes. Those were the dogs, said Gabel. Oh, that that means when you're brought by the camera we whine. Then the music started. Lunch time! They said that it's so scumbag eating a hamburger and don't eat a hot dog. <laughs> so Gumbel could embrace herself in TV again. Hey Gumbel, look at me! <gasps> Wait! No! No! This can't be the end! No! 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 No, this can't be the end! I was laughing so hard! No! No! Hot dog! Dolly said, eating it. Uh, I'm used to what Gumbo said, chewing her 
mouth open. Psst, they're looking at us, Dolling whispered. Oh, hello, Gumball and Dolling fans. That's right, lunch time is an expression. Just like when I recorded, I. <gasps> This was the best story! This was the best story of my childhood! And it didn't even have a proper ending! No! Like, it's like my old self was saying, Oh my god, this story is too good and funny, so I should not finish it. Like, why did you have to fuck me like that? Like, this was the best story of my childhood, like, this was better than the love combat, and you just had to end it like that! You just have to not even finish the goddamn story! You just have to end it with a cliffhanger! I mean, sure, the love combat ended with a cliffhanger, but at least that has, like, the first part has an ending, even it was cheesy as hell, but... No! Can't believe it. I can't believe the best story of my childhood got a cliffhanger. Like, it's like my old self was saying, Oh no, I'm supposed to write terrible stories, but this one is just too funny, so I should not finish it. I don't even want to throw this into the pit of hell because, like seriously, that, that, that was too good, that was too good, it doesn't deserve to be thrown into the pit of hell, like, that was so, like, I never laughed so hard, <laughs> that was the best one, and you had to end it, you had to end it, you I don't have another one, so I need to grab, so I, like, that was the end of the series. Like, you just had to end the series that good, but then not finish it. Just... Uh. This is the end. You can to end me like that! Yeah, that's it. Like, I'm gonna remake this. I don't care if I have to, like, postpone some projects. Like, I don't care if I have to, like, you know, postpone, like, the Obioculum video. Just... I'm gonna remake this. I'm gonna remake this. Like, it was just too good! I'm gonna remake this, and it'll be the best shit that you'll ever seen on YouTube, on my channel, cause why did you have to end it like that? You just had to! Like, I was so <sighs> Just, goodbye. I'm not even gonna draw this into the pits of hell, just good, goodbye, just goodbye. New series, new hell of a story, just, 
I'm gonna cry my soul now. Like, you just have to clap and go me like that. I'm gonna remake this. Goodbye. So long. Sayonara. Bye.